Hello YouTube and welcome to another episode of The Cloudy Vape. Alright, in this episode we're going to be talking about my go-to mod. This is the iGo W6 along with the Sentinel M16 clone. We're mostly going to be talking about the Sentinel MC... M we're mostly going to be talking about the Sentinel M16 clone. I think this is probably one of the most underrated clones that there is. It is a scoping uh, style mod with a spring button, but out of all the mods I have, I would have to say this is the best. And that is just my opinion, uh, but after trying a different types of tube mods, um, variable voltage, different things like that, this thing just fires up. I never had a problem with it, and with the scope on it, you can pretty much change it to any size. You can take your battery out like this. You can scope it down to smaller batteries. But the cool thing with these scoping mods, if you've never used one, um, you pretty much you put your button on, and if the button doesn't fit flush, you see that? You just unscrew this a little bit, screw it in, and really the contact to the battery is perfect because you can get it nice and tight, just like that. It has a reversible uh, locker, but never had any problem with this, so let's uh, check it out. All right, here's the Sentinel M16. This is my go-to. I absolutely love this. See, you take it apart, you got your top part. This is one piece. There's nothing really rattly in here. Um, so uh, I guess your con, if you are OCD about how your atomizers sit on this, your RDA might sit a little above um, or it might not reach it, but this is pretty, the pin in there is pretty close. So really no matter what you use, you're gonna, it's gonna connect. I haven't had anything not connect on this, um, but this is not adjustable right here, just so you know. But really what I'm saying is it's gonna sit higher if you have another one, you know what I mean? So that's just one thought. So you have your one part of your scope. This part comes off. You have your other part of the scope, which is a centerpiece. See there's little heat holes right there. Just nice. And then you got your bottom part. And those pretty much are exactly the same. It's all broken apart. And here's your firing button. And the firing button's really simple. You have your Adelrin insulator. Set those down. Yeah. Take it apart. Just unscrews. Just got it. Here we go. And here's the spring. Goes back on just like that. And just pop that back on. Put a little pressure on it. Twist it back in. Boom. Again, you have your lock right here. So, let's put it back together. Bottom part. Get your center piece. Get your top part. And your 510 connection. And there it is, Sentinel M16 clone. So that was the Sentinel M16 clone close up. Again, I got this at 101 Vape. Check it out, it's probably about 20 bucks. You cannot go wrong buying this mod. If you like this video, if you found it helpful, go ahead and hit the like button. If you have any questions about this mod, go ahead and comment and I'll try to answer. And if you like my videos, go ahead and subscribe. And as always, Stay classy and keep vaping.